Gradually, the fireflies came into a position directly above the cars. One wing over each of the radio cars and a massive fuselage over Virgil's master car. With barely a yard separating the cars from the fire flash, Virgil shouted a command to the fire flash pilot. Fire flash from Thunderbird 2. Cut engines. The port wing of the fire flash suddenly dropped dangerously near the ground. Fire flash, lift port wing, lift port wing. The engine sprang to life and the wing rose just enough for the radio truck to race into position beneath it. Cut power. Okay, Fire Flash, reverse thrust. The Fire Flash was now totally supported by the three elevator cars, but by now they were running out of runway. I'm applying brakes down here. We're not gonna make it. We're running out of runway. 